Howdy all, lovely to see you all again. Thanks for being patient. Today we're gonna to be looking at the second solo at the end of Buried Alive by Avenged Sevenfold. Let's take a look. Alright guys, so just a quick reminder, we are in standard tuning, which is pretty crazy for a Ven 7 fold. Anyway, we're going to start off with this little lick. Pretty E minor pentatonic. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do two bends from 15 of the second string, full tone. So I do a long first one, and then the second one's a little bit quicker, and I'm going to bend it up. And then I'm going to hit it at the top of the bend and pull off. At the end of that, I'm going to roll down the pentatonic with the cheeky flat 5 note. I'm going to play 15, 14, 12 on the 3rd string. I'm just going to pluck the 15 and then pull off the 14, 12. That's what we have thus far, and then I work into this phrase. Let's slow that down. I'm playing 14 of the 4th and rolling to 14 of the 3rd. And then I'm going to play 14 of the 4th and then 12 of the 3rd. I want to get to that 12, I'm going to slide from 12 to 14 and then back to 12 again. So we're going to go at the end of that, resolving to 14 of the fourth string. This is what we should have so far at a gentleman's pace. Okay, after that I work into this cheeky pentatonic lick that kind of works from two note per string patterns into three note per string patterns. So I want to start off by playing 12, 14 on the 4th, 12, 15 on the 3rd, cheeky flat 5 note, and then I've got this. So the 2nd string will be 2 notes, so I'll play 12, 15, and then when I get to the 1st, I'm going to play 12, 17, 15, 12. Let's have a look at what we've got thus far. At the end of that, I'm going to play 17, 15, 12 on the 2nd string. And then 15, 14, 12 on the third. And I'm picking all of this. So all together of this new chunk. Hopefully that's all making sense. And then I work into this quick legato bit. Let's slow that down. I'm going to do a pull off playing 17, 15, 12 on the first and second string. Then I do pretty much the same idea again but I'm gonna start off the first string by playing 18, 15, 12. The second string would be the same. So back to back, we're gonna have... And at the end of that, sexy vibrato on 15. That's the whole section. Let's take it from the 15 bend at the start, we'll put it all together, and then do it again even slower with some tabs. One more time with some tabs. Okay, let's have a look at the second and final section. I'm gonna start from 17 of the second string with my middle finger and I'm gonna play this little arpeggio. Let's slow that down. I'm playing 17 of the second, jumping to 16 of the third. Then 17 of the second again, and then 19 of the first. So all together. At the end of that, I'm gonna to go to that cheeky spooky note on 18 of the first string. After that, my next kind of arpeggio idea from the third string, I'm gonna play 16, and then 17 on the second, and then rolling to 17 of the first. So all together. At the end of that, playing a cheeky 15 on the first string. Nice and spooky. And then the next part I pick all of. And that's just working through a pentatonic across two strings. So I'm gonna play 14, 12 twice on the third string, then 14, 12 once on the fourth. And at the end of that, rolling down the pentatonic, I'm playing 15, 14, 12 on the third. So all together, 
Let's have a look what we've got thus far. Okay, the second half of this is very, very similar. We're gonna do this. All the way up to that 15, and I'm just gonna end it by bending 17 twice. And that's all of the second section. So let's do it all relatively slowly, and then again, even slower with some tabs. One more time, some tabs. And that was the second solo from Buried Alive. Hope you guys have enjoyed that. Please like and subscribe and check out the details to my Learn That Solo Facebook page and my Patreon account in the description. Catch y'all very soon.